This is Twit. My app cap is an app called WatchSmith. And Leo, I think you're going to love this one. Uh, WatchSmith is an app that lets you create the closest thing to customized watch faces as you're going to get on the current state of Apple Watch. Leo, let me post a link in the um, in the Notion for you to pull up on your screen okay. here. I'll put it down under the app cap section and... It's a Mac Stories article, but it has some great screenshots in there, and it shows how the uh, WatchSmith app works. So with the WatchSmith app, you can create individual complications that take up different parts of the screen. So there's infograph circle, infograph corner, infograph top, modular, the extra large complication. And with each of those, you can set up things like the current star field in a given space. You can set up the tide. You can set up date, sunrise, uh, timers, all of these different options that you can have change throughout the day. So you create individual uh, complication Ooh. settings and then you schedule it. So I can say, you know, from this period to this period, I would like for this complication to show. But then whenever we get to 2 p.m., so maybe at the, at the start of the day, you want the weather But then as your day goes on, okay, you've got your weather. Now you'd like that to change to your current activity or you want to know uh, the tides for some reason, I guess, if you're a surfer. Um, Or I I like the the star field option, which shows what the stars look like directly above you. This cracks me up because it just – people really want to customize their iPhones and their Apple Watches and all Apple devices so much. They have to jump through such crazy hoops to do it. Yes. And this app is a perfect example. Bizarrely complex. Bizarre. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. Just crazy app um, <laughs> that lets you do something, but only because Apple just won't provide any facility to do it. They just say, no, you're not going to do it. We don't want in you fact, to do it. They get 37, in your way. 37. They do. They get, they get, they get in your way. They don't want you to do it. Sometimes they really push you out of there for yeah, sure. Yeah. Uh, 37 complication styles across 10 categories, date, time, calendar, activity, weather, time. I'm looking at this going, I don't know, what the hell, what is this? (laughs) Plus, as with all of these, it's slightly ugly. It is. It is. Once it's on your watch, like it, it looks good on the watch because it's just the little circles that are available on the watch. And so it does look good on the watch, but the app itself... The actual structure of the app is <laughs> is not very pretty. Yeah, <laughs> I blame Apple. I don't blame the, the the developer. Did what they could, yes. given the limits of what Apple will let them do, and this is what you get. And you don't throw a fit. A fit. No. How much <laughs> is it? Uh... Uh, so it's free for most of the complications, but if you want certain complication categories, then you pay, I believe it's a $1.99 a month for premium or $19.99 a year. So free for most integrations, and then you pay extra for uh, about 10 complication styles and categories. So really most of it's for available for free, honestly. Um, which is which is nice, but yeah, I like I said, I think that it's handy having the complications. So, for example, on my watch, I have the weather in the top right corner of my uh, watch, and to be able to have that, yes, I want to know at the beginning of the day and maybe midday what the weather, the temperature is. But do I want that slot to always have to be taken up by the weather or could that change? And so that's what this allows you to do. Whatever you want to put throughout the day, you can set yeah, uh, like whether it be time, idea. date or yeah. tides or whatever. Yeah, It's a complicated app to make complications. There you go. A yeah. complicated complication creator. Nice. That's WatchSmith by underscore David Smith, as he is known. We just call him Undy. Undy. Yeah. <laughs> My Undy. Undy. Hey, Undy. How you doing, Undy? <laughs>